Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, depending on when you're watching us. Welcome to Twitter News Weekly, and here are this week's top stories. WrestleMania 30 is on the horizon. Ooh, yeah, I love it. This Sunday, 30th anniversary of WrestleMania, live from the Superdome in New Orleans. Fans all over the world have been flying, taking a train, taking a boat into New Orleans, ready for the granddaddy of them all. But what we're interested in is what does Twitter have to say? about WrestleMania 30. Let's go to the tweets. At SarahHawk1 tweeted, Am I the only one not participating in watching WrestleMania 30 this year? Maybe I'll finally get some time into a good book. You know, you got 364 other days to read a book. You gonna pick WrestleMania? Books. Books are stupid. I hate them. At Phil Brooks guy tweeted, at Dave Batista is the best, and at WrestleMania 30, Dave Batista will be the new face of the WWE. So deal with it or go fuck yourself. Should be Batista's new slogan. I'm gonna be the WWE champion, so deal with it or go fuck yourself. Ah, uh, Dave, can't say the F word. Got to fire you, buddy. Can't do it. And at Vince by Demand tweeted, I just realized I have to watch Game of Thrones the day after because of WrestleMania. Aw, oh, shucks. Now there's a man who's got his priorities in order. There's only one WrestleMania. DVR Game of Thrones. You know, you can see the boobies and the blood after. I like your style, Vince. While perusing Twitter for a suitable topic for Twitter News Weekly, I came across a hashtag that I could not pass up. Hashtag questions I wish I could Google. Now let's see what some questions you have that you wish you could Google and get the answer for. Perusing, great word. Peruse. Peruse. Perusing in Peru. That's how I have my, my dream. I'm going to be in a bookstore. Perusing for books in Peru. I'm not going to read the hashtag for every single one of these, but remember the hashtag is hashtag questions I wish I could Google. And let's see what the first question you wish you could Google. At It's Me, Danielle V said, What's that one song that has that beat with that one girl? Uh, the song you are looking for is Roar by Katy Perry. At underscore dreadhead underscore J said, did I pull out in time? Looks like you're going to need to use Google to find the nearest Planned Parenthood. At died many times said, how can I earn money and not do anything? Well, you can. It's called being homeless and you can panhandle. Get your cup ready. And another one by underscore dreadhead underscore J. How much more can I drink till I pass out? Some things you have to learn by doing. At E underscore aren't asked, who let the dogs out? Now, everybody thinks it's the Baja men, but I have under good authority that it was my neighbor, Kevin. Your 2013 World Series champion, Boston Red Sox, opened up the season on Monday. They're actually playing right now, so far, 1-1 one one on the season. Also, they got to visit President Obama at the White House. Johnny Gomes with that freshest blazer. Let's see what Twitter has to say about the beginning of the 2014 season for the Boston Red Sox. At underscore Ali Flores tweeted, Everyone better start competing for my love because I have an extra ticket behind home plate for the Red Sox-White Sox game. Well, if you like out of shape, moderate alcoholics, huge wrestling fan, I can grow a pretty nice beard. My name starts with the letter R. I don't know. I'll probably make a pretty good companion for the Red Sox game, just saying. At Amazing Ariel tweeted, Really cannot wait for hot dogs and margaritas at the Yankee-Red Sox game next week. Margaritas, A+. Plus. Hot dogs, everybody knows. You go to Yorkie Way, you get the sausage or pepper sandwich. You get one before the game, you get one in the third inning, the seventh inning, and then you get one after the game. That's four sausage or pepper sandwiches, okay? Believe me. Trust me on that. And at Puckhead716 tweeted, I was thinking of the Red Sox today when I was teaching. A pre-K kid shit his pants. First team I thought of. It's bizarre. It's really bizarre, but thank you. I appreciate that as a Red Sox fan. And those are this week's top stories. Be sure to tune in next week, same time, same great YouTube channel, youtube.com slash theaveragenobodies. Hey, and while you're checking out the YouTube channel, why don't you like some of our videos or all of our videos, and make sure you subscribe to the channel. And be sure to follow us on Twitter, at Average Nobodies, and of course, check out the blog, averagenobodies.com. Throw us some comments. We'd love to hear from you. And if you want this fresh shirt, be sure to head over to AverageNobody's.com slash store to pick up your beer drinker t-shirt. We all know you're beer drinkers. Just accept it. Come over to the dark side. You want a shirt. You want to drink a beer. 
we know. The first step in getting help is admitting that you have a problem. You can't climb a mountain without the first step. That's what I've always said. That's sort of right. Hmm. Well, until next week, I'm Matt. I'm Ryan.